if you use a lot of set states in your application, it's going to slow down your application, which is not performance optimized. The reason is it's going to rebuild the whole widget tree again and again. Now let's go ahead and check that out. Now over here is my console and at the top within this build widget, I have this print statement. Now I'm going to go ahead and click on this. And as I click on this, each time I'm going to see that it's going to print out building the widget tree and definitely this is not good when your app is medium to large size so you want to avoid that and how to avoid this to overcome this massive performance issue we can use something called value notifier go ahead and declare your variable using value notifier and after that the widget that you want to rebuild again and again wrap it around something called value listenable builder make sure that you attach your variable here and with this, you will see that your app is more performance optimized. Over here in the console, we can observe this thing. So as you go ahead and increment the value, you don't see that it prints again and again. It just simply prints once or twice at the beginning and after that it never prints. So value notifier is a great way to optimize your app. The problem is as your app gets bigger, you also don't want to use value notifier. You should use something called GetX, Block, or RebelPod, and that's the way to go. If your app is medium to bigger, then definitely make sure one of those three. And we have a lot of tutorials on that. And if you like it, don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button.